Our goal with the BlackBerry Passport was to create a serious mobility tool, one that would change and improve the way professionals use their mobile device. This was about creating something better, something unique, something with purpose. When we asked ourselves questions of, and we didn't have a solution, that's where the innovation came in. And it's layered throughout the product. Because we base the phone on the format of a passport, there's a sense of familiarity when you hold it in your hands, yet something is still very new. I think what amazes people when they use the device for the first time is the size of the screen, the amount of content they can experience. When you turn the device on and you see the big square display, there is a delight when the, the screen comes alive. And, and then there's an exploration or a journey to some of the other features, such as the, the capacitive keyboard, for example. BlackBerry has been known for best-in-class keyboards. We took it very seriously when looking at how to improve on that. So the physical keyboard also has an on-screen presence, something that's adaptive, that changes with, um, with content. To allow the frame to function as part of the RF antenna, we created a split in the bottom where we located the connector port. The steel I-beams used in modernist architecture uh, really inspired the integration of the frame into the body of the device. And with the BlackBerry Passport, it really creates this, this unique shape. The gentle shape of the back cover feels great in your hand, but also allows us to incorporate a much larger battery. There is something about leaving the laptop at home and really having that one device that'll get you through the day. We designed it for somebody who's looking for a durable product, a reliable product, and a beautiful product. It's for the person who wants to get more done.